think it's very easy to fall into the angry black woman hole if you're ever serious for a moment. For me, it's always good to reinforce these stories and just roll around in them a little bit and absorb them and understand that this is an important part of the patchwork of what is Canada. City Line's Tracy Moore is one of 15 interview subjects in Cool Black North, all of whom come from a wide range of life experiences in the arts, entertainment, law, business, science, and social activism. But while their stories are unique, they all share a common resilience and strength, overcoming racially based obstacles to succeed. And I don't even like to say black, I just like to say Canadian. Period. Cool Black North debuts tonight as part of Black History Month. Earlier this week, Rogers Media and the Black Business and Professional Association hosted an exclusive advanced screening of the doc in Toronto, where our Terry Hart caught up with the talents involved in the project. What was it about this project that made you want to be involved, Darren? Well, I think that any project like this that calls attention to the important and groundbreaking work that, that black people are doing in our community and around the world needs all the help it can get because we need to find ways to unify our planet at some point it has to happen so it's got to start with these these types of things i think it's so important to be involved and mirror the people um, that we have within our community and uh, and so it was not even a second thought we decided as soon as we heard about it that this is something we had to jump on what did you want to explore with cool black north Oh, Cool Black North is all about black excellence, black excellence across the country in places that you wouldn't even expect it. And I just was tired of hearing, you know, for the longest time that black people don't do things in Canada. You hear that sometimes. And this program shows all the things that black people are doing across the country. It was just like, there's so much to say. This could actually be a series. I bet it could. Hey. <laughs> and I think this is why we have a Black History Month. We still need it. Why is that annual celebration and recognition of the black community important and crucial for society at large? Black History Month is crucial simply because we don't get this history all year round. And so, almost unfortunately, we've got to dedicate a month to focusing on this community and how this community has helped build the wider nation and the wider continent. Catch Cool Black North tonight on City TV. If you miss it, you can find it on demand on the City TV app or on citytv.com. For City News, I'm Devo Brown.